Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to New Orleans. I'm Gary Harris. We are continuing our coverage of the college football playoff semifinal matchup on Monday night in the Sugar Bowl between number four ranked Alabama and number one ranked Clemson. Now the Crimson Tide practiced for more than two hours in the Mercedes-Benz Superdome on Thursday afternoon. Bama wasn't in full pads, but the energy level was high. Of course, on the defensive side of the ball, there is still disappointment over the loss of linebackers Sean Deion Hamilton, the, sen the senior, and freshman Dylan Moses, but enthusiasm over the return of backers Kristen Miller, number 47, the junior, Terrell Lewis, number 24, the sophomore, and Matt Wilson, number 30, also a sophomore. Meanwhile, on offense, Jalen Hurts may need to play his best game at quarterback that he's played since he's been at Alabama. And offensive coordinator Brian Dable wants to make sure he does. Both met with reporters on Thursday morning at media headquarters inside the Marriott Convention Center Hotel. As it gets later in the season, if you're not improving, usually you're not where you want to be. So, and even when you get to a spot like this, there's, there's again, you get critiqued and evaluated on every practice um, here. Everybody's held accountable. Um, everybody's held accountable. So, you know, we have uh, we have a bunch of guys that, that try to continually improve on a day-to-day -day basis, and uh, that's what we need to do. You know, people always tell me about the number of wins I've had this far and all that, but. I mean, I don't remember the wins, I remember the losses. And um, that's something I kind of always carry with me and, and how I carry myself. Meanwhile, defending that.